Alright guys, welcome back to the next video on the channel and today we're going to be going over Ultra Space Wonders. Now this is the finale event to the Season of Wonders, so let's get straight into this and what this um, event is about. So, this event starts on May 23rd at 10am and will finish on May 28th at 8pm. The bonuses for this event are going to be 2 times XP for winning Ultra Beast Raid Battles. Really good as this whole event is about Ultra Beasts and we're going to get into that right now. So, Naganadol emerges. This Poison Pin Pokemon will make its Pokemon Day debut. Starting with this event, trainers will be able to evolve Poipol into Naganadol by using 200 Poipol Candy after catching 20 Dragon-type Pokemon with Poipol as their buddy. Now, that is going to be very difficult. It is not going to be a lot of Dragons in the event. I don't know what's in the Wild Spawns for this event, so we are going to find out that together. Um, not only that, we have Stack Attacker emerging... Um, in five star raids in the eastern hemisphere, uh, Blasphalon, I think it is, Blasphalon, will be making its way into western hemisphere as well. So they're the two new Pokemon from Ultra Beast anyway. Now, if you're like me and you can't obviously go to the other places, you do have things like Poke Genie that can get raids. However, get ready for a long, long wait. For me to get my first Stellar Stealer from Poke Genie, it took... 25 no 125,000 people now that took I think 24 hours just to be able to get into the raid so there is a lot of people in these queues straight away so as soon as you know this event is started get in a queue now remember that it's not your time that it starts unless you're the first place in the world to reach that time so definitely keep an eye out on time zones and take a look for yourself and see when the first events will start now, the following Pokemon will appear more frequently in the wild. You will, uh, for the first time, you'll be able to catch Shiny Marini. That's cool. Um, so you've got Ekans, Zubat, Tentacool, Coughing, Stunky, Krogunk, Trubbish, Skrelp, and Marini. And if you are lucky, the rare spawn is Dratini. Now, appearing in one-star raids, you will find the following Pokemon. Paldean Wooper, Hisuian Quillfish, Hisuian Sneasel, Bagon, and Dino. Appearing in 3 star raids, you'll see Galarian Weezing, Drudagon, and Turtonator. And in 5 star raids, you'll see Stack Attacker and Blastphalon. Whilst in Mega Rage, you'll see Mega Pidgeot. Good thing the Mega Pidgeot's coming back, as it hasn't been back for a little bit now. And um, there is going to be field research tasks to get Jangmo, Gumi, Marini, Trubbish, Nidoran on both uh, genders. Now, during this, the special research for World of Wonders is the final part coming out. And your complete task to get XP, Rare Candy, Mysterious Components, Encounter with Empheme Pokemon, and Poipol Candy. Really needed for this event, Poipol Candy, if you are going to involve yours. Um, the five star, uh, sorry, the five dollar paid time research will go four premium raid passes, one lucky egg and more, Encounters with Marini, and a Naganago Wings as an avatar item. It's... No, it's still not worth it for me. So say the Naganaga wins, say 250 coins. Four battle passes, 250 plus 100. So you're looking at five, 500 Poke coins. Now if you bought them on the web store, you're looking at about five. So you're not getting any extra for your money other than encounters. And I don't see that as a massive thing. Obviously it is up to you guys if that's how you play the game. Perfect. Definitely do what you want to do. However... I will not be purchasing that time research. Um, Shiny Marini does look pretty cool though. And then obviously you do have the things like Ultra Raid Box. And then you've got two new avatar items. Naganagal Jacket and Naganagal Pants as well. Other than that, that is all the information we have during this um, video. But you do have three new Pokemon coming during this event, which is massive. So you've got Naganagal, Stack Attacker and Blashvalon. Now Bash Blashvalon, if it gets its move, is... It removes 50% of your HP while dealing a massive amount of damage to the opponent. So hope if that's in there, that's big. But there's nothing about attacks here yet. So I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you all for watching. Please leave a like down below. Comment if you are going to be doing raids for these Pokemon. And also subscribe to the channel if you are new. And I'll speak to you all in the next one.